Do you need to have an undercut haircut to have the curtains type of hairstyle? That's what we're talking about today. So I'm going to explain what the benefits are of having undercut, may you, why you may want it, may not want it, and that's what we're talking about. So basically, for an undercut, why would this work? Why would you want this type of hair style? Well, simply because if your hair is really thick, let's take this mannequin right into here, and if you see, there's so much hair on the sides. If I were to shave all this off, you'd have an undercut, right? You could part it down the middle, have that curtain type of look, but if you don't, you still have all that length on top, but then you've got so much more hair here on the sides as compared to this other mannequin that it's all gone. So if you've got really, really thick hair, okay, really super thick hair, and you're just tired of dealing with it, you want to have the ability to style it a lot easier, and you're like, I have way too much, then get an undercut, right? You can manipulate the hair much easier, style it, you can work the hair, you can tame it, and it's not gonna feel like you've got so much hair on your head. That's the biggest thing, right? Depending on the variety or the different lengths you want is up to you. So this, in particular, this undercut here is, I'd say like a number like three up to like a number four guard, right? You don't have to have a skin undercut, but what this does is it actually just makes it a little bit softer looking. So if you were to slick your hair back, it actually has the illusion of it looking like it's blended, but it's not, it's actually disconnected. And for all those asking what's disconnected, disconnected means simply that there's a certain point where the hair, the shorter hair stops, the longer hair begins, and it's not blended. So it's completely disconnected. That's what disconnected means, it's not blended. And you could have a, a variety of hair lengths. It doesn't have to even be that short or that long. Here's another example of an undercut with the kind of curtains type of hairstyle. I never called it curtains before. That's a popular term. It's just to me a center parted haircut. So here is where the hair is obviously a bit shorter. And what I've done is faded this in. So you can have a faded undercut as well, or a faded kind of curtains hairstyle to where you know, if you do slick this all back, why would you get a fade? Well, because it may look like a nicer transition from shorter to longer. That can look super nice as well. Then you've got another example. If, you're ha if you've got really fine hair, or like I said, you have thick hair, but if you want to go really extreme where this whole thing is actually just completely shaved, like skin, almost like what I have right through here, just completely shaved, it's going to be a very drastic look but it's great for wearing the hair slicked back. It's awesome for finer hair, for lighter hair colors, uh, very, very straight hair that's, that's a bit more on the finer side. And you know, if the hair hangs down like this, it's gonna obviously cover it, but when you slick it back, you're gonna see that extreme type of look. So again, like I mentioned before, if you don't have an undercut, then what's gonna happen? Well, you can have that center part, right? You can have that length through at the top and the hair coming down like this, all right? But again, what's gonna happen is all this hair into here is going to be relatively heavy. If you are okay with that and you wanna keep the hair a little more modern, you like having hair through at the sides, you can always trim this down shorter than the top and still have it blended in that's not a problem. You don't have to get it disconnected or a severe undercut. If you like having the feeling you wanna be a little more sophisticated and you wanna feel hair, then you don't have to get the undercut. So it's good for both people. You know, uh, I think either option is something that you can embrace. Let me know if you do, ha which one of the two or three do you have? Is it faded? Is it like just like a skin or a one guard on the sides? Do you have the under, like the curtains hairstyle where it's all blended in together. I love to know. And don't forget, if you are purchasing any of my products, use code YouTube20. That's YouTube20 and free shipping in the US on orders over $50. Let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.